to get a measure of turbidity or the amount of sediment in the water, you will use a turbidity tube. So the reason that this parameter is interesting is because the amount of sediment can affect uh, plant and animal life. If you have too much sediment, not enough light will be able to penetrate through the water, and so you'll have less plant growth, which feeds less animals. And then if there are fish in the water in particular, they can be affected by sediment in their gills, and then also as eggs um, in development. So right now this tube is full of water. We just got it out of the Maumee River and you'll see that there are measurements on the side. What we will do is you will have one person use um, the tube at the bottom to let water out and another person will look in the top and you will let the water out until you can see that black and white pattern on the bottom that you would see on a secchi disc and then we will take a measurement from there. Okay, so we have let the water out until we are able to see the pattern in the bottom. Uh, that will vary depending on the stream or the river that you're in. Uh, this water is from the Mami, and as we know, it's called the Muddy Mami for a reason. Uh, we got down to about 15 and a half centimeters. Uh, there are some streams that we sample in our area that you can see it when the tube is completely full. So it just depends on where you are.